Hey, Chris Matthew here. Experimenting with computes.io. Uh, if you recall, uh, last weekend I built a Beowulf um, mini supercomputer out of four quad core Raspberry Pi 2s uh, and a gigabit Ethernet switch. Uh, I have the, the post here if you go to uh, beowulf.computer, uh, you'll, you'll, you can read all about it. Um, but then I was experimenting with a Raspberry Pi Zero which I thought was really interesting. Uh, you know, the price points come down to uh, $5 for a Raspberry Pi Zero. It's only one core, but it's uh, a, giga, a gigahertz uh, processor on it. Um, I put a four uh, gigabyte um, uh, SD card in it. So that's a, a dollar a gigabyte nowadays. So $4 for the SD card, $5 for the, the Raspberry Pi Zero. I bought a uh, $3, a little less than $3, uh, micro uh, USB to Ethernet um, adapter, which is pretty awesome. So if you plug that into uh, this, the Zero, uh, the power cable is also uh, less than $3. Uh, so what do we got? So just round them up. Uh, 5, 9, uh, 9 plus 3 is 12. 12 plus 3 is $15. So $15, we basically have a, um, a processor that we can add to computes. You'll see the image uh, that I put on this SD card on beowulf.computer. Uh, it's a real small image that just boots the, uh, the, the uh, Pi Zero uh, into a, a computes core, attaches to computes I.O. and waits for uh, computing instruction. So if we... Uh, Go to computes.io, you can see in the top uh, right corner there how many cores are connected. I'm going to go ahead and attach the Ethernet uh, onto this device. So we've got uh, uh, Internet uh, connectivity. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to plug this uh, USB just into my uh, Mac here for, for uh, simplicity's sake. And what you'll see is as soon as this uh, Pi boots up, you'll see these cores jump. Uh, currently, it'll, it'll jump by two because I, I have a, a bug in the way I'm counting it, uh, which is fixed uh, on the next next release. But you'll see as soon as it boots up, it should go from 28 to 30. And basically, this Pi Zero is online waiting for computer compute instruction, uh, which I'm really excited about uh, turning this little guy into uh, Beowulf 2, maybe a stack of uh, Raspberry Pi Zeros. So he's booting up, and any minute now, we should see the cores uh, jump up. I see some chatter on his Ethernet. There, oh, I see 29. And 30. There we go. So uh, I don't know, less than less than a minute, maybe 30 seconds. Uh, the the Raspberry Pi Zero just came on on board, gave another core to the Computes.io um, uh, supercomputer platform. Uh, so I would encourage you to try to build the next Beowulf on on these little uh, zeros. Fifteen dollar uh, cores, pretty amazing.